basically like our new series called Sample Go, and we had like uh, all the way from 600 watt to 1200 watt. Yeah. And there's an uh, Edipass design and Edipass Go, so basically uh, efficiency between 87 to 90. Okay. So what's so special for this power supply, you can see there's three big trademarks here. This is actually one of the patterns. We have an innovation on the transformers. So we can direct the heat outside to a heat sink. So we can reduce the size of the, the, the transformer. Yeah, it's like 20% smaller. And next one is, this one is including the efficiency. We put a control IC next to the transformer. So we can have a real time monitor the performance of the transformer and the controls. The last one will be this. In the, in the, all the traditional heat sink will be parallel. So, but by the L shape placement, so we have the more space pulling down the, the, the components. Uh, this cooler is actually a. Uh, Actually, a, a silent-oriented cooler that every detail setting are, are for for um, best performance efficiency under very low fan speed. So it means that like uh, the fan gaps are actually wider than normal coolers with uh, two millimeters uh, between and uh, seven heat pipes with a traditional copper base. But we put the uh, uh, extra aluminum extrusion hissings here, so it will have uh, extra cooling when the fan speed is really low. And uh, we put a uh, we will put a uh, a PWM fan with a lower fan speed range. It, it's similar fan to V6 GT, but actually the um, we target fan speed which should be around 600 to 1600, so meaning that less than than V6 GT. And uh, uh, other things uh, like uh, there are certain kind of uh, channels cut off the the fins, so this can release the release the air pressure a little, uh, mean the resistance a little bit. So uh, when the fan speed is really low, the rear part will get a better airflow rate compared to with uh, compared to without the uh, channels. So basically this cooler is uh, optimized for uh, fan speed on around 800 RPM. On, uh, not like the V6 GT. V6 GT actually optimized for two fans configuration at 1500 RPM. So the characteristics are totally different between these two coolers, although they have a similar size. Uh, this is a code name, we call it a B5, uh, Gemini B5. It's the second generation of our uh, pro product called Gemini S. And uh, we make it bigger, higher, and the performance better than the last version. The, the most important difference is that in last time we put the, the cooler uh, originally for 9 centimeter fan and it can be up for 12 centimeter fan. But this time we put the 12 centimeter fan on and uh, got the optional position to accommodate a 14 centimeter uh, fan. So it means that uh, we have to make the the thin areas wider to have a better performance. Still same five uh, solid heat pipes with a, a traditional cover base, but uh, all the details like the thin gaps are optimized for better performance. So um, we actually working on a new kind of bracket, but because it's not confirmed yet, so we didn't show this time. So maybe next version, uh, you will see a true, um, true uh, setting of the new products.